in this thing. It's beautiful. Really it's beautiful. Governor Andrew Cuomo led a tour of the new station with city, state, and federal officials and many who worked on the project. Nearly a decade to build the three-station line, it is a much different approach to the subway system. It really is state-of-the-art. So it's not only done, but it is really well done. And it's impressively done. Uh, and we're all proud to be part of it. The project, with its dust and noise, was hard on the residents who stayed in the area. It was hard on businesses, some forced to close. Joe Pecora, a businessman, was glad to see this day. It's unbelievable. And I can't wait to ride the train and uh, be part of this great community and serve our community. The governor began pushing for a January 1st deadline, and the MTA promises to make its first Q-train run on New Year's Day. Jackie Carson worked on the project. We started, it was on paper. It was just on paper, and now it's real. It's fantastic feelings. The public got their first opportunity to see the 96th Street station at an open house. Many wondering for years what it would look like. But it's really cool, and really big and colorful, which is different than others. Looks great. The artwork was really nice, and uh, they did a great job. And uh, a lot of hard work for the MTA, and, and uh, it's good for New York. And the open house continues tomorrow. There are two times from 8 to 10 in the morning and from 5 to 7 in the evening. Reporting live on the Upper East Side, Tim Fleischer, Channel 7 Eyewitness News. Tim.